Novotech was born uh, more than 25 years ago as a spin-off of the University of Naples Department of Aerospace Engineering and uh, for uh, the first 20 years we worked essentially in uh, engineering uh, application for uh, uh, general aviation uh, aircraft. Essentially uh, we tested ground vibration test and also we have uh, responsibility for uh, aeroelasticity certification and other application. Uh, more than five years ago, we uh, in this region, in Apulia region, we decided to start uh, another business, another activity that was uh, mainly de dedicated to composite structure manufacturing, advanced manufacturing with focus on the autoclave process and we got a very significant machine made by Coriolis in France that is applied the technology of automatic fiber placement technology that is one of the most used today technology for building a small, medium and large aircraft like the Boeing 787 and other aircraft. Uh, Novotech now is focusing mainly in uh, research activity. We are running five different projects, all dedicated to composite and uh, one of these is uh, the night project that is uh, one big project uh, financed by European community. NITE stands for New Hybrid Thermoplastic Composite Air Structures manufactured by auto battery and continuous automated technologies. The research started uh, last May 2017 and will last for three years up to next April 2020. Novatech is the coordinator of the research and the consortium is composed by eight partners coming from six different European countries. It's a good balance between university, research centers and also small, medium enterprises and large aerospace companies. Knight project is developing concepts and methodologies enabling the realization of a green and innovative composite air structures produced by a new thermoplastic hybrid material, recyclable material, uh, with multifunctional capabilities. Uh, this material responds to the need to have uh, reduced weight and consequently reduced fuel consumptions and emission of an aircraft, as well as for less costly and, uh, uh, of course, uh, less consuming manufacturing processes. The uh, typical air structures is a fuselage panel or part of a wing that will be produced by an in-situ consolidation automated fiber placement process uh, for the skin panels. Then we make the stringers by continuous forming process and at last, the assembly is performed by induction welding process. The first step to go uh, and make this kind of structures is uh, uh, composed by the production of hybrid material that is performed by an uh, automated hot press. This automated equipment that was developed in partnership with Orma Machine and Comec Innovative is, uh, is very new because it's able to consolidate uh, peak carbon prepared material together with uh, amorphous PEI films uh, in order to reach the final new hybrid thermoplastic material. So the hot press is able to consolidate a peak carbon prepared material up to 400 degrees Celsius. The hot press has a working area of 4,000 mm by 700 mm and is featured by several heating zones uh, in which we can heat up to 400 degrees Celsius and also cool the material while applying different pressures along the press plates. Uh, the manufacturing process relies on the, uh, an opening-closing cycle of the press plates while uh, that is synchronized with the, the translation of the material after reaching the final winding spool. This new hybrid thermoplastic material responds to the need to have reduced weight and reduced fuel consumptions and emission of an aircraft as well as for more ecological and less costly manufacturing processes. Furthermore, it is a multifunctional material in the sense that it returns both function of toughness improvements since it's a multi-layer material but also process simplification because you don't need to have autoclave consolidation that means improved cycle times and lower cycle costs.